Hello everyone. This is Nit from Set Commerce. Welcome to the instructional video for Walmart attribute mapping using our Walmart integration app. Attribute mapping helps you in mapping your Shopify store product attributes to the predefined Walmart attributes. After watching this video, you will be able to map your Shopify product attributes easily. So let's start. Log into your Shopify store. Go to product section. For example, we would be using the product type supplements. As you can see here, this product with product type supplement has variant option pack of count. Also check other necessary informations are properly aligned like SKU, vendor, price etc. Now to start the mapping process go to Walmart integration app here we would be doing attribute mapping. Click on products in the navigation panel. Then go to category mapping and make sure that the product type is mapped with Walmart category. Now go to attribute mapping section. Here you will find a list of all the categories mapped in the category mapping section. Click on one of the category. Here in this case we will click on health and beauty. Now you can see the two types of attributes variant attributes. These help in creating the variants on walmart.com recommended and optional attributes. These help in creating good listings on walmart.com. Click on variant attributes. You will find the list of Walmart attributes and next to it you will find Shopify option that you have created on your Shopify store. Here in this example pack of count. A few product categories on Walmart have predefined mandatory attributes which means the mapping of the same has to be done individually. Set the required mandatory attribute as no. Remember, if you will set the mandatory attribute as yes, you need to provide the value of the attribute for each of the product that belongs to this product type. Now map the pack of count of Shopify to the count per pack of Walmart. Let's move on to the recommended and optional attributes. Here you have two options to set the value. You can either map the Shopify option with Walmart attribute or set a custom value. We will map the key feature to the Shopify option. Shopify product title. In the same way, fill in the rest attributes. Now click on save to save the mapped attributes. The attribute mapping has been done on the category level. But if in case you want to put the value of mandatory attributes, you need to go to manage products, filter the supplement product type that we took as an example. Now click on the products edit icon. Click on category and attributes. Here you will see the mapped attribute. 
scroll down to the common attribute this is the required attribute set it as yes fill in the value in the below text field now click on save this is how you can edit the attribute mapping of all the products at individual level thank you for watching this video hope i helped here